Hello, viewers. I'm SB. And I am Amabel. And welcome back to Lorelei. And the check out these laser eyes. Look at all these laser eyes. Very laser. They're very, very laser. Eyes. These eyes. <laughs> Thank you. All right. So we lost. We got all got all a little bit screwed up last time. But let's do the thing here. So all right, you. Okay. So no. I'm thinking you're thinking the when the number is most square to camera. So then the two is this like H. Okay. All right. Well then. Can you make I a think... note of that? Okay. Do you do you have the other I, ones written down already? I think so. Yeah. Can we just let's, okay. just humor me? Let's, let's yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's go to the room. Let's go to the room and try it. Let's go to the room and try it. Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm gonna ask you. Yes. To give me the numbers. Well, I'm, I'm going to, what I want to do is try them not in order because I want to see if it, if it is order or if it's just pressing the right four buttons first. Okay. So. All right. So try that uh, little tuning fork. That's the this second one? one. Okay. Yeah. All right. Try the H. The H. Try the cross. This and one. Then try the, yeah. Try the other cross. Okay. All right, that does not work. Okay. And then in so, the in the proper one nine three two order, it would be uh, the the other cross, so the this that one? one, yes. Okay. And then the nine is the tuning fork. Okay. The three is the cross cross, and, and then, the, then the two is the H. Okay. That also doesn't work, actually. Okay, well then I either didn't let's write them go. down correctly. Yeah, or... let's go back to the room and record the shapes again. We okay. may we may have a shape misrecorded or something. Yeah, because I was. We'll we'll get it. We'll get it. Yeah, we'll get it. <clears throat> Baby, we got this. Baby, we got this. Okay, we so. Got this. This is the two most squared camera is the H, no doubt. Okay. Um. So the the number on top of the camera is going to be most square like this. That's the one. Yeah. Uh, so you have this shape is sweet. Okay, try that one. One, one of them is going to be this. This is the okay, three. Okay, that's going to be the three. And then the other one is going to be this, right? Yeah, that's where the nine yes. is most square to camera. Okay. Yeah, so I didn't write them down properly. Is what I <laughs> okay, fair enough, fair enough. But assuming this works, then yeah, do you still want to try them? I do. The I do still want to see if order? it's yeah. I do still want to see if it's just the four symbols because we don't yeah. we don't actually know yet. We didn't uh, with the other one. We put them in in the order the first time, and maybe it doesn't matter because we could always just put them in in the right order. But I'm curious. Okay, so uh, so it's one of them is this right. One of them is that. And that's not the one? That's not the one. Okay, so this well, is, the one this I got is right. a good wrong order. Okay. Okay. <coughs> uh, and then it's H and H, this thing. Uh, the first one, yeah. And what else? And, this? uh, hang on. Um, no, the the one to the to its left. Okay, right, yeah, the, the squat one, yeah. Okay. Okay, so now let's try that. It does. It does seem like it probably is order based. The squat one, and then the uh, little doorway. Okay, uh, okay this yeah, one. Right, yeah, yeah, that one. All right. And then the very first symbol, and, and then, then the, the H. H. Yep. Okay. Now we know. Is it valuable to know that? I have no idea, but now we know it. 1932, in Frankfurt am Main, Lotte Weiss gave birth to a to a girl child. Lot, Lotte? Lottie? I don't know. It's probably Lotte, right? Yeah, maybe. Uh, she was the first of three girls born in as many years. From one of the few remaining photographs, we can see that she was a small child. Her mother looks proud with little lore in her arms, while her father appears as a blur, leaving the frame hastily while the picture was being taken. Okay. So 1932 is Lorelai's birthday? I think so, yeah. All right. Okay. Um, do we... What other, what other keys did we have? 38, 48, 32, 53. It doesn't note... It doesn't do you the kindness of, uh, 
like noting which ones you've used or taking them from you. So we're gonna there's gonna be a little bit of uh, trial wait, and error. Yeah. Wait, is, is the thirty two key there? Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, okay. So thirty two and fifty three we have done. Yeah, I don't remember which rooms is where. And I guess we can look at the map, but like you have to actually drag them um drag the magnifying glass over each of the rooms to know which door it is, which is a little bit annoying. Yeah, the map thing's a little they really, I, I, they really wanted to maintain the like mecha the mechanical purity of their single interaction button idea, and I guess I get it, kind of. I mean, you, you can you can give us two, but we can handle two buttons. We are professionals. Okay, forty eight was forty. Nope, oh, sorry, I'm not trying to look at the brick. I'm trying to look at my inventory. Can't do things separately. Only got the one button. Forty eight is one. Forty eight is one of the keys. Yeah. Ah, uh, and I keep trying to press escape, even all this time. Into the game. 52.6% of the truth into the game. I keep trying to hit escape to go backwards in menus because it's just so, like, it's so programmed into you. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is interesting. 1948. Video installation. In our life, we are always looking for directions, be it to get home or move forward. But in 1948... The artist instead presents us with the idea that how we turn is equally important as our direction, even suggesting that they are one and the same. Well, I guess let's see about that. There are ten marked film rolls. Okay. All right. Starts the film roll marked zero. Okay. Hold on. Uh... Okay, so it's it's the it's the two crosses of buttons box. That's interesting. Uh, start the film roll marked one. <laughs> Amabel, I'm I'm having some difficulty interpreting the clues we're being given. <laughs> Well, that's turning that way. Gosh, what, what are you making of this? I does this I'm, make sense I'm to not, you? I'm not. I'm not. Okay. I, I want to verify that they're all kind of the same thing. That there's not another one where it's. Oh. Shoot! 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 Hold on a second. I want to save before we get map manned again. <laughs> sweetie, sweetie, please don't Sorry. do that. Oh, it turns out I can't interact with objects once this is begun. Well, crud. I'm sorry, it was scary. I'm very easily scared. Okay, it's not, though. Oh, come on. It's a little scary. It's a little scary, all right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me, let me see the room. Okay, so here's the lady has fallen. There is there is the rose next to her. Over here is another lady who sure looks like us. There's a praying angel overlooking the scene. There's a smashed sort of thing. There's an apple under the bench. It doesn't really seem like... Oh, hold up now. Ah! Revolver in the... What do you call that? The, is it... It's not a planter. Uh, I think it's like a bird water thing. Like a bird feeder or something. Or a okay. bird uh, pool. Okay, and this guy's got a handheld film camera behind him that Lorelai really does not want to get out of the way of. Or, sorry, our character <laughs> does not really want to get out of the way. Our mysterious character. There's a top hat on the bench. Yeah. Do I remember? I think so. Ask me how many apples. What object was behind the broken urn? It was a watering can. A watering can. Okay, they're using the word urn for that thing. It's not 
what I know as an urn, but fine. <clears throat> Exterior, garden, night. The woman runs outside and finds the man standing by the body. She discovers that the body is, in fact, a mannequin. Its body is broken in every possible way. The woman stares at the man, wanting an explanation. Solemnly, he raises his head and meets her eyes. It was self-defense, signorina. I had no choice. The woman tries to catch her breath. She stares at the doll again. What is the meaning of this? Oh, that is the age-old question. Who's wielding the paintbrush? Where does red come from? Can art provide meaning to a meaningless existence, or is it just a game to fool the senses? The woman frowns, but the man is oblivious. But enough about my work. The maze. Great progress, yes? Uh, no, I'm stuck. Could you tell me? Wonderful! Getting stuck is one of the key parts of the process. You are an amazing artist. But I am keeping you from your art. Leave the disposal of the body to me. Huh. It's just a mannequin, though. It's not like he... I don't know. I think this game's doing a, a really interesting thing with this guy where it's like, um... You know, to some extent, it's it's kind of playing on that, like, that, um, like, gift of fear thing where it's like... I am having a hard time telling how much it is reasonable to be, like, scared of this guy. To be worried that he might do something to us. And there's definitely a part, a part of me that is like, um, you're overreacting, and I'm, I'm like struggling between those two voices. Yeah. No, I'm being silly. No, he's dangerous. Well, he could be dangerous. I'm like, how much am I overreacting, and how silly will I feel if I'm overreacting versus what if he kills us with a gun? Okay, so six is six is sol solid and stationary again. This is part okay. of what I was curious about. <gasps> oh. Okay. I, I figured it out. You think you have it? Yeah. And nine is, okay. All right, t uh, talk to me, because I still have okay. nothing. All right, so, uh, so it's the left and the right sides. So it's telling us which number corresponds to which set of buttons. Um, and it's the, the direction it's turning is telling us which of the buttons it is within the cross shape. So if it's not moving. Okay. Okay. It, no, that makes it's, sense. That it's makes the sense. middle. If it's turning to the left, it's. So, so one is. It's going to be on the right one side. One is right, right. Right, right. Okay. And then nine. Nine is left, left. Left, left. Four. Four is right, left. Okay. And then eight. And eight is left, right. Okay, that's not confusing at all. <laughs> all right, while we're here, 1960 is not one of the keys we got, right? I don't think so. 60. Two was okay. Yeah, because we have and this thirty-eight as well. Okay, because we have the sixty door right here. Actually, let me look at the map of this area too. Uh, so we're in this room. This is the study with the heart door. That's room nineteen sixty. Um, investigation office nineteen seventy-three. Okay. Um, I guess let's just go to the um, let's go back to the puzzle room and. Uh, the puzzle box room and throw this in there. Yeah. I don't know if this is the fastest way, but this is the way that was most direct in my brain. Okay. Okay. Uh, two crosses. So it's going to be right, right, right side, right button. Yep. The left side left button, the right side left, and the left side right. <coughs> Pardon me. Okay, I remembered to hit the cough button that time, like a professional. 
<clears throat> a portrait, presumably of her father, Walter, as I remember him, 1948, is scribbled on the backside, is her earliest known work. The technique in the drawing bears a strong resemblance to computer graphics of today. Using only thin ink lines to create connected triangles, an image of a face is created, making this one of the first, if not the first, known examples of polygonal art. Walter, as I remember him, 1948. Okay. So the, the 1973 date, or the 1932, yeah, 1932 is her birth. Mm -hmm. This is 1948, so it's it's telling us what in what way each of these years is significant in her life, and then yeah. we have a series of years that's significant in the life of um, Renzo. Yeah, that we track by his the movies that he's making, and so the number of dates that we're having to pay attention to keeps ballooning. Yeah, I'm gonna go and make sure that I save immediately so that we don't get maze manned out of a puzzle box here. And have to go resolve it. Although it's not like it was very difficult. Well, it took us a moment to figure out what. Mm, it took you a moment. I didn't actually figure it out. All right, what else? What else is around here, doors wise? Uh, in this area, the only big lock is room 1957. Which we do not which have. Which we do not have? We have 50-something. 50 53. Yeah. I'm right in thinking that we don't have the, um... This oh, we have. 38 we have. This oh. we have. <clears throat> You're right in thinking... That we didn't have the piece of information necessary to move forward in the maze, right? Like, I don't think we had ever heard... Yeah, yeah, we haven't heard that guy's name at all yet. All right, we'll figure it out. We'll get there. Yeah. Huh. All right. Mixed media installation. Using modern techniques, the artist plays with perception in 1938. Twisted perspectives appear correct, small appears big, yet always with an equal. We are thus to believe the truths come in pairs. Matching our own truth is another truth, hung on display for everyone to see. Okay. So I can zoom the camera. That's interesting. We have paintings on the walls. Huh. And we have these numbers. Okay, none of none of them are going to give us any other detail than what we can see naturally. So Huh. I mean, we um, can we can see that the paintings of the paintings on the like the paintings on the right wall have matches the painting on paintings on the left wall, right? <clears throat> yeah, they're not in the same order, but they well actually does this one this one doesn't, right? Maybe they're not actually the same. See, because I was thinking that this and the one directly across from it are the same, but. I guess they're not actually, right? Like, the dot on this one is smaller. I think. Okay. Hmm. Um. The numbers map to the painting somehow, or... They give you they give you a an intended perspective for this puzzle, which is interesting. Yeah. Always with a pair. Always with a with a twin. Matching our own truth is another truth hung on display for everyone to see. This. Okay, this is the one. This this puzzle box is the one with the five the two sets of five buttons. Yeah, and there are two sets of five pictures here, yeah. so but what do we like how do we map that the one nine three eight to the pictures to know 
Are there details in the texture of this? I don't think so. No. Not, not like not not like that would be meaningful. But these pictures. Maybe the pictures are. <clears throat> Maybe the photos are of the 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 um, stone number figures from an angle, from a different angle, or like a cross section or something. Oh, but the, like okay. this would be a one. This would be the one, right? But there's two that are just a simple small dot. I don't. This doesn't. I think that doesn't work. I think that doesn't give us anything. But they have to correspond somehow because we have to be able to. Mm -hmm. match painting to number so that we can figure out which paintings are the 1, 9, 3, and 8. That's got to be the way it's formulated, right? Yeah. Hmm. I mean, I assume as we... I mean, I would assume that as we zero in on or frame so a number is visible, we do something to... to you know, one of the well, the big, foods, the biggest, the happening. biggest problem is that the one is over here, right? Yeah. The one is straight back. It's a forced perspective puzzle, and it's—I mean, so far they've been pretty simple. There's no way to turn the perspective of the camera such that any other piece overlaps the one. Like, we can get the three and the four to overlap if we look at it right, and I was wondering if there might be something to that, but... Yeah, um... Wait, is it about what painting... The, well, the one doesn't overlap a painting, though. No, there's no but way, like, like there's the no way from the, the forced perspective point. Twisted perspectives appear correct, small appears big, yet always with an equal. Twisted perspectives appear correct. Hmm. The thing about pairs would... I feel better with it if, with the fact that we have, like, only three big pictures. Which does not really lend to a pair. You know? No, because the pair, the pair is a the painting and the number it represents. Hmm. Okay. Right, they have to be, otherwise there's no way for us to divine an answer from the gallery. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, this one I'm stumped on. Yeah, we don't have to figure it out right now. We can come back. It might, it, it, you know, this might be like a pretty simple thing that we just, neither of us um, intuitively grasped. And maybe it will maybe it will pop when we come back. It is like it's interesting though that they're not they're not all quite the same shape, right? Like Yeah. This is a square. And it's a pretty square square. Oh. You can sort of see it kinda looks like a seven, huh? Oh. But like this is not this is not a square. This this thing has um Oh actually no, it is perspective it is a it is a, it isn't a square in the frame, but it's a square when looked at from exactly this perspective. That's fun. <laughs> but this one is as well. Okay. That's well, maybe... Boy Boy, they sure don't look like it, do they? <laughs> no, they don't until huh. you Well, that's something. I mean, obviously, you know, you're not, they're not all actually like the same size as the thing, but also just like the, the obviously diagonal edges. That's a cute perspective thing. I mean, all the shapes are going to be exactly square too. What does that give us? What does that do for us? Oh, 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 this is about right, right? Yeah. Okay. Who is the perfect size square? You are. Oh. And it's just the one? 
So when we're painting over here, that's close but not right. So could you please write down that uh, the the eight is like the middle left painting? And I'm just gonna verify that this is not the same, not the right size for any of the other boxes. All right, I'm a little leery on this because it is pretty close on a couple, but it's not, but it's not quite. But okay. this this could be an answer, right? Yeah. So let's also try the what? This okay. is which room? 1938. This is the 1938 room. It's the it's the puzzle box that has the the two rows of five buttons yeah. on it. Because the the buttons correspond to the paintings. The buttons yeah. are laid up the same way the paintings are. So this is about the right size for the three. And that makes it the second from... On the, the right, from yeah, the bottom, the, yeah. Yeah, the second from the bottom on the right. Because when, okay. when we're looking at the box, the buttons are arrayed vertically. Okay. You also need the nine. Yep, 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 yep. Let's try to dial that in as close as we can. Pretty good. So, um, second from the top on the left side. Okay. There we go. And the one is second from the top on the right side. All right. I'm feeling pretty good about that. Yeah, good job, sweetheart. Um, prov <laughs> provided that it turns out to be the answer. So right now we're in the loft. The other locked door in the loft is a storage door that we just don't have a key for. Let's let's go look at that again real quick just to refresh okay. me. Um, oops, before we head down is what I was about to say. But after is good too. Oh, the revolver door, right. Sure, sure, sure. is a bit of a walk. <laughs> That's a cool puzzle. Yeah. I... Can I say, I, I really, I, I feel like most of them have been, most of the puzzles have been, like, very easy so far. That one, I think, is actually, like, kind of tricky. Okay, on the right, go down one. Yep, yeah, that's okay. the one. Uh, then go directly over to the That's the left. Yeah, that one. All right, uh, then the three. the three is on the right, is second from the bottom. And then, and then the eight is right middle, below right? the... Yeah. Rad. That's, that's a cool one. Her parents started worrying about the situation in the city, and in 1938, they decided that she should go live with her aunt in the country. Aunt August was, uh, had suffered several nervous breakdowns, and her grip on reality was, at times, fleeting. She would, however, look back at the four years with happiness. My aunt taught me uh, what she pieced, pieced together about art, but often forgot to feed me. She prepared me well for life as an artist. <laughs> okay, do you want to mention that name to the old lady? I want to save the game real fast. Because now we've solved two puzzle boxes and I am worried about the amount of progress we're making. We're, go we're going fast. And I don't know for sure that that's what triggers the maze man, but like, you know. Okay. And then I'm going to slip these scripts under the door here. Okay. Yes, yes. Pages, 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 pages. So many pages. I do. Let's give you page three. What do you think it means that we're being like, how do you, how do you process the metaphor of what's going on here where we're being pursued by maze headed entities that give us, that show us scenes that form themselves into script pages to be written up by the man who appears in the script scenes and is overall responsible for the design of the place where we're getting you got anything have, here? 
I'm, I'm, I have, no. Okay. Like, it's... like, there's something there, but, you know, the thing about, about metaphors is they often give us, uh, useless words to express the ineffable. Was it, well, her, her hand's name was... Uh, August, uh, right? Uh, yeah, August with an E. Yeah. Okay. Oh, all right, all right. Oh, dear, that... Uh, happened to her head. Okay, uh, let me let me write that down. Let me, let me. I mean, it said memory recovered, so it's gonna. Oh, okay. We'll we'll have a memory of that. Okay. Well. Yeah, we wanna we wanna like name her. F family members to her. Yeah. Okay. Walter? Wal Walter was the dad's... I was about to look it up. This is curious. She is, she is relating to us pieces of the puzzle, but in a way that seems maybe not all that healthy for her skull. There's a lot of... Uh, yeah. Sort of reshaping going on there. But these are completely different. These are all right. Uh, all right, all right, all right. Are these visions? No. These are memories. Okay. So the, yeah, they're they're in the uh, they're in the visions tab, and they're labeled by numbers. They're labeled by the number of the puzzle box that had the page where we got the piece of information. Okay, but we solved four puzzle boxes, right? Yeah, I'm trying to figure out where where is it storing our page the pages. Uh. It's not signs. They're not books. Documents you would think would be would be acceptable, but apparently not. Those are lost script pages. Game testers notes and the notes from the door. Okay, these are just the signs in the galleries. Mm -hmm. Pictures of the doors, which we've not even found all of yet. Seems like maybe we don't keep the memories of the things from the gallery. Curious, but also she is like right above it. Yeah. So we have four boxes open and three memories. What did we, was there one, was there a name in the one that we missed? Uh, Cabaret. 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 Say, do you happen to remember this cafe? I don't have any idea. I don't. We've not seen anything in the game where that looks like it could be. How much more game is there? How many more puzzles? Like, and probably a lot. Apparently, and we're just over halfway through. If we were trying to one hundred percent. Yeah. So we yeah, used just... all the keys that we have. No. The, the room keys? No, we have more. five. 48. 62 we haven't done yet? 62 we haven't done yet. Um, let's see if we know where that room even is. So let's see here. This is East Hallway. We would want like an E key for that probably. 
judging from the way. So room uh, 1962 yeah. is in a place we can't get to yet. Okay. Okay. I wonder about the first video game. You found a way to cause a crash in that second video game. Did but, I? But we didn't do the same. Yeah, we didn't we didn't cause that mm. kind of thing to happen in the first one. Hmm. I don't know exactly what the utility of that would be, but we could we could go have a look. Yeah. Uh, we also have we have some toy blocks that don't fit in the cube like slots in the gallery. We also have, we have some playing um, uh, some playing cards. Oh, we do have an E-shaped key. Hold on. What the... Oh, okay. Well then. Hold on just a damn second here. <laughs> well, let's do that. How I long have we been also... holding on to that? <laughs> been in our purse the whole time we have we have, um, a, we have a lot of stuff there's a lot of things going on wait this isn't the right how do i get to the place where that was i want to go through the piano room which we get to from above okay yeah so go to the elevator to the next uh, i think Yeah, I think it's the elevator, which we can access pretty quickly this way. I guess it would have been just as fast to walk the other direction. Whatever, it's fine. Okay. Still don't know how to interpret the music. Oh, all right. This big, asshole again. You big baby, let's rumble. <laughs> the like the Cold War spy elements of this are really bizarre. <laughs> yeah. It's it's I, and I guess this was true of uh, Sayonara Wild Hearts too. It's so many things. It's so many pieces of so many things. Yeah. So let's see here. He's... You can see, like, an easel behind the glass. Something's written on the ground. Lupus in fabula. A uh, wolf in story? Something. My man has left four footprints on the ground. There's not a lot else going on here. Yeah. Wait, there's something... There's a revolver in the bottom of the, the plate glass window. Okay. All right. Let's try it. Oh, well, that's easy. Yeah, that, that was going to be an easy one, just due to the the relatively small number of objects in the in the room. Interior hotel lobby dusk. The woman comes back from her walk with Rudy trotting alongside her. The man is waiting for her. He is standing by an easel on which there is a prop window placed. It is poorly painted with red paint, half finished. The man's clothes are stained with red paint. Had a nice long walk. The woman does not notice the change in his demeanor. The man is shaking from barely concealed rage. He pulls up a notebook from his inner pocket. What is this? The woman squints at the notebook. Well, it's, it's my early sketches for the maze. Is something wrong? Well, it's just a lot of numbers. It's vectors and coordinates for the computer. Take responsibility. Don't hide behind the OCU-3. I'm not. It's just that to create anything with it, I need to. And this window. I had to paint it. My I had to paint it red myself. I stained my favorite suit. Well, I I didn't know that you wanted. It's your job to know. Well, to do my job, I need some directions. <sighs> directions are for tourists and amateurs. 
Simple people who paint waterfalls. I hired an artist, one who understands the rules of the game. I must say that I am very disappointed in your lack of passion. The woman takes a deep breath as if to calm down and change her approach to please the man. Look, I'm, so I'm sorry. This project is a bit confusing at times. What is the window for? The man stares at her in disgust. Well, perhaps you should paint a waterfall instead. The man hands the woman her notebook and then storms off. She notices a piece of paper stuck in between the pages. She pulls it out. Meet me in the chapel tonight. Do not tell him. The way she's having to manage his... Oof. Yeah, it's probably... Uh, familiar to people who have been in certain kinds of arrangements. Yup. Um, if you want some additional cultural context, yeah. The so so the the Latin uh, lupus and Fab, it, that, that is wolf in the story, mm -hmm. and it's an it's an idiom which is uh, like the equivalent of like speak of the devil. Oh, okay. Uh, could you get oh. me shortcut number yes. six? I love how useful I feel in this series. Because I'm like, oh yeah, I got it written down. What, you mean because you're, cause you're solving 80% of the puzzles? That's not accurate. The answer is three. Three indeed. I mean, you are the one that solved all these puzzles. Not all of them. So Almost like, all of the SU Bolt puzzles Where does were. this go? There's a scent of coffee wafting through the door. Um, uh, is it the coffee key? The sea key? Yeah. Here it is. I'm, I'm like looking. I'm. I feel so silly. I'm looking at the teeth of all the keys in our inventory. I'm like, where the fuck is that sea key? But right, it's right here. Maybe we will finally get ourselves uh, number eight, please. Number eight is ninety nine zero. Okay. Maybe we'll finally find a way to drink coffee. Or maybe we've always had the ability to drink coffee, and I'm just a goober. Yeah, but then you'll start to managing, start having to manage your bladder. So do track that. It's never really come up. A cafe, just what we need. Yeah, how are you feeling there, the Signorina? Please take a seat. Mm. Door 19 is right behind us. Ah, like black magic flowing through your veins. It makes you think faster. Did you know Americans dilute it with more water? Have you heard about the Black Arts Coffee Club? I hear that they have struck a deal with this hotel. For a small fee, members get unlimited coffee. Unlimited espresso, signorina. It sounds like sunshine on a Wednesday. Why not give them a call? 097807. Life is short, signorina. Only the fast carpenter catches the best wood. Yep, that's... I have to run. The Black Arts Coffee Club. Okay. 097807. Let's, uh, first of all, turn on the music in this room, because there is a... And then is there anything else? There's an espresso machine, of course. A dollar! One American dollar. One American dollar. Okay, what's, uh, door 19? 19 is 30. Three, zero. I only have five shortcut doors left. Is this going to lead outside, or...? Yes. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Okay, check, check if there's a... Is there a rose anywhere around her? Or is it just red shards? Uh, no. No rose. Hmm. There's an 1847. Okay. In any case... 
We've also gained access to 1962. Oh, right, and the stairwell to the oh. um to the other part of the basement, which is really important. I don't remember why it's important, but I remember that it was important. Let's do this part first. Yeah. This is, by the way, um, way more fun doing it with another person. I really appreciate the uh, really appreciate yeah. you doing this with me. Well, thank you. I like doing it with you. All right, 1962 urges us to look around, perhaps even out the windows of our own personal space, to let symbols meet ideas. The work is open to several interpretations, but the artist leaves us a clue when examining its symbolism from specific perspectives. Beliefs are only true when beheld in solitude. <laughs> hey, try not to hold beliefs that that's true for. So we have some figures outside. We have a handheld film camera. Oh, this is weird. So I can walk around. I can't look up or down. I'm assuming if I try to leave the room with the camera, she puts it back. Nope, you just actually can't. That, that is a hard wall while you're holding this. Okay, so. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine. Okay. Ten, eleven? There's eleven. Hmm. No, 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 there are ten. There are ten non-number okay. shapes. And this is the 1960... The 1962 room. 62 room. Alright, so those shapes correspond... That's, well, that's a, is that a six? Is what a six. Also, I mean, the shapes correspond... Okay, so the one... Can you pan the camera back? So the one's going to be that shape that's on the right? It is? I think so, yeah. You're that or that shape's the four. But... Ooh. But there's only two figures in front of this window and there's three shapes. But if you turn a, a directly around... Uh-huh. Okay, never mind. <laughs> no, I was wrong. Well, I was thinking about, like, you know, we had that puzzle earlier where it was, like, the shapes were being denoted by the number of angles in a... Or the numbers were being denoted by the number of angles in a shape. But we don't actually have a pure circle. Like, this, ha this has sides cut into it. So we don't have a thing that would represent on a zero in that system. Yeah. And this shape over here, this, the, the lower one... One, two, three, four, five. So there's six, there, there's ten points on that. Which means it actually has 20 angles. So that's definitely yeah. not what's happening here. No, no I, I definitely think that the shapes outside the window correspond to shapes they are reflecting inside. Okay. But I don't know. Yeah. So hold on, what is the... Okay, put this thing down. 1962. The door just had a star and a, like... The door just has... Okay, it has the shapes in the corners. I don't remember this puzzle box. Hmm. If I'm being completely honest, um, <clears throat> would you mind if we just left this for a moment? Yeah. I went down those I stairs. I don't mind at all. Interesting. A five numeral, five Roman numeral date. Uh, with 2014? We did. Yeah, it might be 2014, right? Because 2014 yeah. would be MM... Uh, XIV. XIV, yeah. Yeah, it's a very simple one. 
I was, I was going to say, I'm pretty sure we did the other two. Okay, another clock. Grandfather clock. The clock ticks, but the hands are still. Okay, interesting. Hmm. Clock face uh, marked in Roman numerals. All right, we'll come back to it. There's a pool table. Also been placed in the triangle rack, but the one, eight, four, and seven are missing. Oh, a dollar. Cool. One, eight, four, and seven are missing. Oh, right. This was important because this was how we get the other toy block. This is where that uh, that pipe leads to. Another dollar. Huzzah. You know, actually, I wonder how much the American dollars, and it being called an American dollar, uh, has to do with the hotel being in Germany. And while we're probably in the present, it's, it's pretending that it's in the... Mm -hmm. the the era the cold war era where you know there were quite a few americans over in in germany uh sweetie 13 13 also we just got the achievement that i think means we've turned on all of the phonographs okay so 13 what we wrote down was 6009 and that can't be right so if we can pull up the puzzle book <laughs> yeah okay let's um hey, hold on hold a, on the gaming system Okay, it is just a standard one of these. I was just curious if maybe the mechanism was weird on this one. All right. Um, photographic memory. Bolts 13. Did we write down the wrong thing? What number is hidden behind the... By, by oh, oh, oh okay. it's a 6-0 six six then. Okay. Okay. Cool. That is, I believe, the entire basement available. So, before we get engaged with this gaming system oh, directly here, there's a bit... Gaming yeah. magazine. You're right? Yeah, it's a magazine. Okay. There are mainly advertisements in this magazine. Apparently, John Romero is going to make us suck it. Uh, super Telegame. Call 612213 to place your order. Express delivery is always included. Uh, a laser eye system. It sure does have a lot of numbers on it. 300,000 triangles on screen with textures. Or 900,000 triangles on screen without textures. Boy, you remember when they used to advertise video game systems this way? Like, it was a big deal. Like, the like the real dig-in technical specifications of the, the N64 and the PS2 in a way that we just don't do anymore. People still talk about the systems in terms of their their power, but they talk about the hardware in a much more um, sort of abstract, high-level way now. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Limited supply, year walk returns, power walk. <laughs> New monsters await in the dark woods, now in impressive 3D. I haven't actually played year walk, but I do own it. I did buy it at a Steam sale at some point. Uh, a bite-sized system. We have one of those. Elo Milo Shuffle. So these, okay, we can get bite-sized cartridges, maybe. Lorelei and the Laser Eyes for the bite-sized system. Device 7. Can you solve the new mysteries and tests awaiting Anna as she travels to a new island with her friends? Maybe. Perhaps. Okay, so right up, right left. Up, down, left, down. Okay, hang on. Let me. Do you remember that? I've never Maybe. written it down yet. Right, up, right, left. Shit. <laughs> down, up, left, down. I think I lost it. I lost it. Okay, it's right up. Are you, right yeah, up. Okay, right left. Right left. Up down. Up down. Left down. 
left now. I would swear. I would swear to you that that's what I did. Okay. All right. 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 Up. Up. Right. right, Left. Right. Left. Up. Down. Up. Down. Left. Down. Left. Down. I really feel like that's what I did the first time. I'm sure it's not, but my brain is my brain is upset. My memory is so bad. Ooh. Is this a carving? Let's see here. Memory of East. This way. Oh no! <laughs> She's exerting dominance over us. <laughs> Uh, okay, so there's a bunch of... <laughs> so I just, do people even know the T-Pose for Dominance meme anymore? Is that like some old school I mean, I, I didn't know it until one day when you just... Well, one day when to assert Dominance, I T-Pose, yeah. Yeah, like, what are you doing? And you, were and then you explained it to me. You were supposed to I remember felt... some owls here. Well, shit, I'm sorry, I tried. Is this leaf a dollar? No, it's just a leaf. Okay. So, if we go all the way forward to the corner, we will discover a dollar. I see it. They were like, they talked like it was going to be a real concern that we might run out of money. Well, you saw the price of those video games we're going to call them by, right? Yeah, I guess. Memory of the great white leaf tree up ahead. Great white leaf tree. Is that what I was... I guess it is, yeah. I can't interact with it at all, though. It doesn't... At least it doesn't light up. Do you remember your way around here? I mean, sort of. So there's something in the bottom right. There should be a sign. And there's a bunch of graves up at the top of the map, which I'm not, like, wild about. Yep, nothing to actually do here. Memory of the lonely grave up ahead. So it would seem... In memory of our thoughtful leader. Huh. That's curious. Can I interact with it? Okay, nothing happens if I interact with it from a different angle. So there are other graves along the way. In loving memory of a perseverant artist. The statues in the courtyard. Oh. Here rests the memory of a Patient soul. I don't know if that corresponds to one of them. In memoriam, a graceful spirit. Maybe not. In remembrance of a modest being. Mm, these are not mapping to the courtyard statues as much as I was hoping. Let me let me come at this other gravestone pair from this side to maximize my dollars. In memory of our quiet son. Mm. Rest in peace, a tolerant man. So it's a bunch of three word sequences with capitalized letters. I don't really know what to make of that, but it's yeah. true. Kind of curious if I can cause the. Um, Yeah, tr so trying to walk through there resets us consistently. Okay. What to make of this? I'm going to try to walk through it from this side. That works fine. 
Huh. That's the only spot we've seen where it does that. I'm trying to figure out whether that is itself some kind of clue, or if that is a, um... Well, it's not nothing. Or, or I mean, if it's just something to creep us out, you know? No, it's not nothing. But what does it mean? I don't know. We'll come back. I want to um, make a couple of phone calls right quick here before we end the episode. Yeah, make sure you, she saved before you do that. I suppose that's a thing to do. I don't want you to get maze manned. Yeah. Oh, the guys are trying to maze man my baby. <laughs> Dudes are do always you, trying to maze man me. Do you need the phone number? Yeah, could you, could you give me the phone number for, I guess, the coffee people first? Okay, wait, where did it, which page did I write this down on? I don't know. How much, okay. no, how much oh. notebook have you used so far? Um, Sounds like a I lot use... of page flipping. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six pages. Okay. okay. Um, so the coffee number is 097807. You have called the Black Arts Coffee Club. You are calling about the membership. You want to become a member. You want unlimited coffee. You want to pay 10 American dollars. Yes? Yeah. Yes. Your money will transfer via the astral plane. I guess that makes as much sense as us getting it out of those video games. Yes. Focus on the membership. Think about the espresso. Focus on the espresso cup. Espresso cup. See the espresso cup before you. Now, the espresso cup. The espresso cup is in your bag. And hey, it didn't even shatter. Yes, you will enjoy unlimited espresso. You will forget everything about the Black Arts Coffee Club. Forget everything about the Black Arts Coffee Club. Forget the Black Arts Coffee Club. Okay. Uh, how about the number for the video games? 61 Hello! Thank you for calling Super Telegame! How can I help you? Um... I mean, we don't really need a laser eye system, right? No. I'm gonna order the bite-sized games. This is very embarrassing. We're so sorry, but that item is currently out of stock. We apologize for the inconvenience. Can we help you with anything else? I believe only the... Okay. Understood. That will be 10 American dollars. Your order will be delivered with Lightning Express to the reception. Somehow, we have mysteriously withdrawn money from you. Please enjoy your game. Uh, yeah, I would love SPLT2 if you got one. Understood. That will be 10 American dollars. Okay. Sick. Uh, I mean, listen, if y'all got a copy of Elo Milo Shuffle... Alright... Uh, and then, I mean, if we could get some Yearwalk Returns. Oh, that's very embarrassing. Okay, and we don't need a bite size or a laser eye. We have... Yeah. Out of curiosity. Okay, yeah. They wouldn't let us do it anyway. I'm going to go ahead and knock out the last thing on the menu here. All right, now we were told the things that you can spend dollars on. Sayonara, Wild Heart. We were told that the things you can spend dollars on were not mechanically meaningful, right? Yeah. Adorable. Join Elo and Milo in puzzling action. It could be Ilo and Milo. I don't know. 
Ilo and Milo have decided to go to the park, but while wandering, the landscape suddenly starts shifting. Now they must be quick on their feet to not fall into the abyss. Control the adorable friends simultaneously and beat your high score as the action gets faster and faster in this fast-moving action puzzle game. This application will take up 32 memory blocks. What? Ridiculous. Nope. nope. This way. This looks intense. Oh, I didn't shoot. I didn't look at the back of the thing. I pressed the wrong button. Forgive me. You are forgiven. Lorelei and the laser eyes. Escape the nightmare maze. Stalking ghosts, gunned madmen, angry dogs, and crazy magicians await in classic arcade fun. You're trapped in the maze, and the only way to escape is to go deeper. Collect power-ups and money while staying clear of enemies as you try to find the nine magical eyes which open the ancient central tomb. Only then can you progress to the next difficulty level. This application will also take up 32 memory blocks. Alright, uh, can we see... Games. Games. Films, games, and scripts. Oh, it does say games, and this, this one just has a long list of things. Okay, I didn't actually look at the back of this. An explosive puzzle sensation. Return to the hypnotic joy of Splutz with brand new elements and a new playing field. Would you believe 32 memory blocks on the internal bite-sized... Oh, unbelievable. Unacceptable. 1916129200. Ooh, okay, they have very different numbers under the barcodes. <laughs> I was just curious. Yeah, it's weird how different they are. But these don't mean anything, right? Or do they? Or do they? I mean, let me just, real quick, I'm just curious. Okay. Can we see how much? No, we cannot see how much memory. There's probably enough. Is the is the thing? Also, this thing's battery life. Very impressive. I installed that already. That's that's in there already. I just, these are not in the order. I didn't interact with them in the correct order. All right, I mean, let's have a look. Okay. Oh no, the magician. Aha, you fool. Oh, okay. The windows are portals. Ah, shoot, 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 shoot. Not a very high score, in my opinion. Yeah. What I Mostly what I was curious about was whether we could collect dollars in the game in a way that would lead to having more dollars in real life. You know, quote unquote real life. Oh no. Ah, I left. Uh oh, this is no good. Are these? Is this sunglasses? Oh, I got the laser eyes. I think. Nice. Okay. I don't know. What if I'm great at video games? Have we given this any consideration at all? I, I haven't had much uh, proof of that, no. That man has a fucking gun. And that feels unfair. Say what you will oh, about Anki, Blinky, and Clyde. Shoot, 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 they shoot, did shoot, not shoot. have guns. Oh, I can't use the window again. No, this is why I shattered. Annabelle. Yeah. Windows that's... shatter when you go through them, and after they've yeah. shattered, they're easier to go through. 
That's how life works. I don't know if that's true, actually. Have you ever done it? No. Well, I have. Aha, you fool. The ghost thought it was so slick. How, how are you finding the, the control here? Uh, it's horrible. It's truly awful to control it. It's very bad. She's very fast and she controls like she controls like championship DX Pac-Man. It's just a lot. It's a lot to deal with. Dog is friend? Dog, dog isn't as angry dogs, I don't think so. How do I? Oh no, I see it, I see it. I see it. No, yeah, you guys go, yeah. Hush, hush, hush. I got it, I got it, I got it. Okay, okay. I mean, I guess I may as well get the other dollars. Let's get all the dollars. Kaboom! $80, please. I did murder one magician. <laughs> Well, Annabelle, yeah. that's a truly unheard of score. I don't feel like I need to play more of this. No. Aww. Okay. Now what, now, what if it turns out that Elo Milo Shuffle is like a banger and a bop, and we just, it just becomes a let's play for that game? Well, I mean, we're going to find out because we're going to look at the others next time. But for right now, I think maybe, uh, Maybe that is where we ought to call it for today. Okay. I feel, I feel like, like we got a lot done this time. Yeah, I was going to say, I feel like we accomplished a lot of things there. We got a lot of the house open. We got puzzle rooms and stuff. Oh, yeah, okay. Yep. Sorry. Right. <laughs> um, yeah, but uh, when you come back next time, there are still more doors to find. There are still more puzzle boxes to open. There are still more strange words to whisper to an old woman who's probably us. Yeah, almost certainly. And the game's just going to keep being like that. And we'll see you then. <laughs>